Hey everybody, Rob Anderson, Clean Power Wash, Salisbury, Maryland, doing a video real quick about Customer Factor. Um, right now I'm working on paying some invoices. So uh, we've already done the work for this customer, Miss Ward. I'm going to just click over here. So we've already created the invoice and I'm going to pay it. And we've got her check down here. We've already deposited it last night. <clears throat> um, so job was 175, change to paid. They paid in full, it's automatic, gift card, no, automatic, no tip, blah, blah, blah. Coupon service, no. Um, data payment, uh, technically paid yesterday, 21st. And her check number is 1294. And scroll down here, email receipt, save. All right, that one's done. So we're gonna go over to, this is also one that we did yesterday. Mark has paid. <coughs> so for Valerie Uten, and here we go. Same thing, date technically yesterday. So, and you can actually, I think it shows right there, you can do job date on invoice, set as the default. Um, that really probably would be a good idea since most times we're trying to get paid same day. Check number 1000. Save that. And now I got one more. So this one actually we did the other day. So we're gonna go to customers. And let's see. Gotta find them real quick. Alright, so this one I did not remember the person's last name, but I knew that it was on Carolyn Street. Went ahead and searched, found the customer, Mr. White. So I'm gonna go down here. And again with these guys, um, please don't call any of my customers. <laughs> um, alright, so job history. So we've already done that, we'd already done, so I'm kind of just show you here, scheduling, scheduled estimate, I already did that actually, and that was for just jobs. Um, <clears throat> but now we're down here, I'm going to click over here where it says invoice, I'm going to check that, and then create invoice. If you click create invoice and have not checked that box, it's going to tell you to check the box. And now you can go ahead and if they have not paid right now, so we could just go ahead and send, email the invoice. Um, I'm actually gonna go to pay invoice since job's already done. That way he will get the invoice and the receipt at the same time and not say, hey, I already gave you money. And uh, same thing with this. That was paid on Monday. And check number is gonna be, all right, so that's done. Email receipt. <clears throat> and that's it. Um, so, I mean, if we want to look at paid in full, do that. And actually, I'm going to show you back now here. <clears throat> so, job history listed as paid, bounce due zero, jobs. Uh, emails, let's see, so we have sent him a receipt, we sent him the reminder email, the estimate email, and now he's going to get, he's already got the thank you email yesterday, and also confirmation. So it's kind of nice, I really like the fact that you can see everything right there, um, again, instead of having to type up a receipt each time, I mean, literally it was what, click on invoices, click on the customer, then select dates, and the check amount so anyways guys i hope that helps um i'm gonna do a whole mess of these videos for the customer factor i really like it um it's not super flashy but it gets the job done lots of other things that you can customize in here to uh, make it look great so have a great day